Hey everyone, it's Ken with Ken's Creations. Well, I just found out I'm going to a graduation and I have to be there by 4 o'clock. And as you can see on my computer, it is 3.33. So I need to make a card and be there in a half hour. And I'm kind of freaking out. Um, normally, I, as you guys know, I like to make a personalized card and put a lot of thought and creation into it and make it a Ken's Creation. And unfortunately, in a half hour, I just don't have a time to do that. So I wanted to figure out how I could still make a card and personalized card uh, for someone who graduated from college because that's a big achievement. And I figured what a great time to look at Cricut's Make It Now projects and see if there was something in there to use. So let's go take a look at it. The way I describe the Cricut Make It Now projects is kind of like the iTunes version of the craft world. There is a ton of different projects you can choose from and you can basically either make it your own by customizing it or you can just make it now. And since I'm in a pinch, I'm just looking for the quickest way to make a project and kind of give the illusion that, hey, I made this myself even though, really, I kind of didn't. But are they going to know that? Well, I guess if they watch this YouTube video, they will. So hopefully they don't. So I'm looking for a card. We're going to come up here to this little drop-down box. We're going to go to cards. Now, if you haven't already done so, you're going to want to come up to this little guy up here and log in. Very important, because if you subscribe to the Cricut subscription service like I do, you want to do that because... If not, you're going to get charged for some of these designs. So if you want to make a card, it might require you to purchase the designs in those cards. But if you're part of the subscription service, it might be included in the subscription service. Now, I'm looking for a graduation card, and I already know I want to make this one here. Now, because I am part of the subscription service and I am logged in, I already have these three images purchased. This one, I am subscribed. So I want to go ahead and make this. So I'm going to go ahead and hit make it now. Um, I know that in the materials, I need my, of course, Cricut Explorer machine. I need the software, which I'm in. I have my mat. I have the Cricut Antiquity pin in black. I have white cardstock, black cardstock, and a glue pin. So I'm going to go ahead and hit make it now. And it's going to go ahead and do everything I need. Um, I also believe I need the score tool, which it did not say. And I need something um, for that congrats, which I'm going to make that in blue because the school colors are blue. So I am ready to hit go. And I'm going to go ahead and record the machine cutting. So you guys, as you can see, I went from the initial design phase to the cutting and it took a matter of seconds. I love the Make It Now projects in a pinch when you need to make a project very quickly to give the illusion that you still put a lot of time and effort into a project. It's brilliant. So if you've not checked out these Make It Now projects, definitely do it because that's what they're there for. They are there to give you that homemade feel and look and element without the time spent. In doing so. So as you can see, I'm gonna make this graduation card in a matter of minutes. All right, let's go to the machine, guys. All right, according to Cricut Design Space, my first is my black. I'm using a texture paper with little dots on it. So we're gonna go ahead and put that into the machine. I'm going to set my smart dial here to cardstock, push my arrows, and hit cut. Excuse the messy craft room, I've been crafting a lot. Alright, the next thing is the congrats, which I am doing in blue paper, because that is the color of the schools. And I might put some stickles on this or some other Thing to make it pop. So we're going to go ahead, put that into the machine. I don't have to change the smart dial because it's still on cardstock. 
And that's what I love about the Cricut Explore, you guys, is number one, it's quiet. I don't really have to raise my voice to talk. As you can see, it's very quiet. And the other thing I love is I don't have to mess around with trying to figure out the blade depth and what do I have to do. Uh, the machine is smart enough. The Cut Smart technology does that all for me. So, um, once again, uh, the Make It Now projects are a great way to create something in a pinch like I'm in right now. And then the next thing up we need is our white cardstock, which is going to be the card. And in that one, we're going to need our scoring tool, and we're also going to need our black and antiquity pin. Now, I get a lot of comments on my YouTubes that, why don't you use spatula, which I do. Um, especially on things like when it gets to this. Um, I just, for whatever reason, do a lot of just pulling it off. And I've actually had luck to where it doesn't rip, so. I watch it rip now because I'm in a hurry, but. The more I play around with these Make It Now projects, I'm slowly falling in love with them. Um, they're great. I can make a project in minutes and have it ready to go. So there is the congrats we will need. We'll go ahead and clean off our mat here with spatula. Or a scraper. And now we need, this will be the actual card. So I'm going to go ahead and place that on there. And this one we're going to want to follow the instructions because this is the one where we need to put our pen and we're going to end up putting, so we want our midnight pen which is this. Now when I put the pen in I usually put another piece of paper under there because I don't want that to end up on my and I just follow the arrows in until I hear it click and then just hit go Now it has, as you can see, done all of the writing of all of our caps. So the instructions say to take our pen out. So we're gonna put our cap back on. And the next thing is we want to go ahead and put the scoring tool in. So we're gonna go ahead and put that in and make sure that's closed. And then go ahead and hit the little cricket head. And it's gonna go ahead and score along there. And now it's gonna go ahead and cut the card. So that's one of the other features I love about the Explore is the fact that it does this all in one take and I don't have to change a scoring tool and then change a um, back out to a blade. All right, and then the last thing it's cutting now is the inner part of my oval here. I'm going to take this out now. Now that we have all of our pieces cut out from the Make It Now project, 
Uh, as you can tell, it didn't take very long. The design piece was less than three minutes. Cutting out didn't take long. Uh, the longest piece of this project was obviously drawing out all of these little graduation hats, but as you can tell, it did an amazing job. So now we just need to put it together so we can get off to this graduation. What I'm going to be using uh, today is I'm going to be using for all of the little dots in the graduation caps, I'm going to be using my Viva pearl pen. You can get these at Joann's and it just gives it a nice little pearl. On the congrats and on the tassels, I have Martha Stewart's glitter marker. I'm going to be using that. For my adhesive, I'm using my favorite uh, Zyron sticker maker and that is for the adhesive. And then I'm going to be highlighting this up above. I'm going to make it pop a little by using my next favorite tool which is my 3D foam squares. So go ahead and watch as we put this card together. So everyone with Make It Now projects at Cricut Design Space, you can take a project and make it with literally 10 to 15 minutes. As you can see, this project uh, did not take me long at all. It took about four minutes to go into the program, five minutes to cut it, and probably only 10 minutes to apply my finishing touches, which obviously you don't have to do. So uh, they've done a great job designing some great projects in Cricut Design Space. I highly recommend getting the subscription service so that way you have access to all of the amazing designs that give you access to many, many projects for free then. Um, so definitely check it out. Make sure you guys are following my blog at www.creativeken.blogspot.com. Make sure you're checking out all my YouTube videos and make sure to hit the subscribe button so you get all of the great Cricut Design Space videos that I have coming up soon and make sure you guys check out Design Space and all the Make It Now projects. Alright, thanks for watching. Go out there and make something magical.